Hello everyone, welcome to yet another series. Have you ever wanted to make your own really cool custom sabers, like the people on Model Saber? Well in this series, I'm going to be telling you exactly how to do just that. Here are a couple of the sabers that I have modeled. I also have uploaded some sabers on Model Saber if you want to check that out. You can also get sabers from my Patreon and you can also commission from me by joining the Discord in the link in the description. In this episode, I'm going to be telling you how to get everything set up. We're not going to be doing the actual modeling just yet. That will be in the next episode. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to do the following things. Install Unity Hub. Install the proper version of Unity and how to install the Custom Saber Unity project. This is probably one of the most important, if not the most important thing when it comes to Saber modeling. It is to install Unity Hub. To do so, open up your web browser and then search up Unity Hub. Click the first link that you see. Now, click on Download Unity Hub. An exe file should now be installed on your PC. Now, click on the exe file and run through the setup. It's pretty self-explanatory from there. Now, you are going to want to install the proper version of Unity to run the Custom Saber Unity project. Now, you are going to search up Unity version archive you are going to click the first link that appears. Now that you're here, there is a specific version of Unity that you want to install. So click on Unity 2018.x. You will now see that there are many versions of Unity 2018. Now, you are going to scroll down until you find the version Unity 2018.1.6. Then, click the Unity Hub button, which will install this Unity version straight to Unity Hub. Now, you have everything set up. It is time to install the Custom Saber Unity project, which is where you're going to be working with with the Custom Sabers. So what you're going to want to do is go to the BSMG wiki by searching up bsmg.wiki. When you're on the website, click 3D Models Guide, then Custom Sabers, then scroll all the way down until you find Miss Rainer's Saber Guide. You're going to want to click on that, and you will see exactly what you need to make a Custom Saber. Next to the Custom Saber Unity project, click download here. A zip file should now be installed on your PC. Now we're not done just yet. Open the zip file with something like WinRAR. Once you open it, you will see Unity project. You're going to drag that wherever you want that is safe, and you can access it easily. I made a separate folder just to keep things organized, and I'd highly recommend doing so. Once that's complete, you're going to want to open up Unity Hub. Now you're not going to see exactly what's on my screen, but we'll get there. Something like that at least. Once in Unity Hub, you're going to go to the top right corner and click on Add. You're then going to find the folder that you saved your Unity project in, and you're going to click Select Folder on your Unity project. Congratulations, you now have everything set up for the next tutorial. Quick note, don't open the Unity project file just yet, unless you completely know what you're doing. Because if you open it, that's where you're going to be working with with the models. And I'm going to be addressing modeling in a later video. Thank you everyone for watching. Please subscribe if this tutorial helped you and if you want to see the future episodes of How to Model Sabers. The next episode is probably the moment you've been waiting for, the actual modeling itself. I will try to make this series as uncomplicated as possible. If you have any questions, please join the Beat Saber Modding Group Discord. Go to PC 3D Modeling and ask your questions there. Link is in the description. Anyways guys, once again, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next episode.